This is kimono leaves. Um, I hope you can see it. It's rather lovely. It goes like this at the back. It has this rather fun collar, which you pop on afterwards. And this garter stitch belt, which you just tie like this. You can either tie it around your boobs, like that, or just let it fall, or just tie it around your waist, wear it over a black dress, wear it snuggled up in bed, very tasty. I don't know if you can see here, but I've put tiny little diamantes These on stitches. Here. This is where you begin the construction of this. You cast on, you cast on for the back section, which is this section here. You cast on here and you knit this back section to here. And, of course, then what you do is you and of course you're knitting the sleeves. You hold the next stitches on waist yarn and you knit one side of the front which is from here to here down and you cast off and you join the sleeve from here to here. It tells you on the pattern card how much and then on this side you then, you've got this, these still on waist yarn, you then uh, got these also being held probably on waist yarn because otherwise you won't have another needle unless you have three needles and then you keep going you do the same for that side you join them here so what you've got is you've got a little kind of tube jacket like a shrug then what you do is you pick up the stitches around the front of the sleeve the, the waist yarn has now all those stitches that you've been holding on waist yarn, you stick on the needle, and all the stitches down here. And then you follow this pattern for the collar. And so as you can see, lots and lots and lots of garter stitch. And then you're carrying on the pattern. And here you're increasing, so it's slightly bigger. And you've got here a, um, a border welt on the collar. This is, again, garter stitch. You've done that with that. So now, what do you do about the next section? The next section, you do, you've done the collar now. So you've got the collar with, you've got the collar with the sleeve section. You then make this bit, which is the, the waistband. What it is, is just some garter stitch. So you're casting on here, and you're knitting, 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 knitting. As you can see, knitting, knitting. And separately, you haven't, it's not attached to anything. It's just a very, very, very long, garter stitch scarf comes up. You then find the middle, the half, if that makes sense, where the half is, the halfway mark of this, and you sew it on there, you put a little mark or a pin, so you know it goes on the central section of the back, which is, you can see, this bit here, this is where you go. And you attach the band this way, and you attach the band this way, to this section here, which is the bottom, the bottom round here of the jacket. Okay, so now that you've got, is you've got sleeves, 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 collar, and you've got your garter stitch band. You can just leave it like that, but if you want to carry on and do the bottom bit to make it a proper jacket, you then have to do the bottom bit. And the bottom bit is very, very simply done. And what you do here is, Along here, you then, it tells you in the card, a pattern card, what to do, but you then pick up all the stitches, you pick up and knit all the stitches along the garter stitch belt, which is along there. And then you've got to carry on, you just keep knitting, keep knitting, keep knitting, following the pattern repeat, keep knitting, keep knitting, keep knitting, keep knitting, keep knitting, keep knitting. as you can see. It's rather fun and it's rather nice. Not terribly difficult actually. Um, these are yarn overs. You have, you have, let me think, you have knit two togethers. You have um, central double decrease, which is a slip slip knit past the two slip stitches over the knit stitch. So you're actually making one stitch out of three. So that's what you do here. This is knit two together, this is knit two together. This is. So this is the, yeah, CCD all the way, really. That's what I call it, central double decrease. There you go, get to the bottom, and I think there are one, two, three rows of garter stitch, 
And there you have it. You have the kimono leaves. This is really nice. And what it is, it's knitted in four of our, I don't know if you can see, very, very soft. This is 100% wool. This is organically farm merino. At the moment, it's organically farm merino for us. And it's called Baby Soft. And it is very, very soft. And lovely to wear. Takes four. You can, you can buy it down there. Um, four hanks. All our yarn comes in those lovely hanks that you have to kind of hold like this and get someone to turn into a ball, which is good fun. It kind of adds to the enjoyment of the thing. And you get these rather well, nice, fun, podgy balls to start knitting with. Don't knit off the hank, it would be impossibly hard and you'll get all in a tangle. And you'll end up like with some Jackson Pollard, not Pollard picture, but the Kandinsky type thing that lots of spaghetti and I don't know, something that Tracy Ann would possibly make. I don't know, something like that. So don't do that. So enjoy, have some fun. Um, I've added, I don't even see here. Yes, of course you can, because I can see them, so you must be able to see them. Some little diamante little beads, just to accent the little corners of a little leafy pattern. It's quite fun. Anyway, that's it. That's the kimono leaves. Over and out. Um, please let us know if you need anything else. Um, contact us. Talk to us. You'll find us on the contact page. Contact button is just up there. Shout to us and say, Bruce, Belinda. I'm Belinda. Um, help. And we will come to your aid, rushing forward through the stratosphere of the internet, of the World Wide Web. There you go.